Emirat Saab is a famous singer. He's a successful singer, see? He's got the sign of success on his hand. Fame and fortune. Fancy sunglasses and chains and jewelry. Posing with expensive cars. Is this the meaning of life? Is this soul satisfying? Is this super original <laughs> and not just copy and pasted over and over again? And what does it take? The Uttara Bodhi Mudra, the gesture of Satan's fake enlightenment. It's deception from Satan and the pride of humanity to pose like this. Very seriously, the world is biblical. Jesus Christ died on the cross for all sinners. How many of us are sinners again? All of us. We need him. Being a good person in your mind doesn't save you. We're all fallen sinners. God's ways, they're much higher and complex than our ways. There's a lot of people why would God be like this? Why does God say this? No one has all those answers figured out. Doing this channel, fellowshipping with you, my brothers and sisters, it's clear the world is biblical. To me, the meaning of life is to have faith in the finished work of Jesus Christ. It's for salvation, forgiveness of sins, and to take part in the new heaven, new earth, and promises from God that are great. He's gone away to prepare a home for us. On screen, a famous person with the sign of success. In this current world, the sign of success is 666. This stuff, sure, it's nice. How long does it satisfy you? Because this stuff wouldn't satisfy my soul. I don't take this stuff with me when I die. Store up your treasures in heaven. That's what God is telling us to do. The prideful gesture of bypassing salvation and, you know, whatever people think, whatever people think they have with this so-called fake enlightenment. Heaven is real. Hell is real. Please think about your options, the truth, and Jesus Christ and salvation today.